So I got this Matic, it's a two and a half pound Husky. I'm trying to uh, modify it so I can use it one handed uh, when I'm tunneling. I'm working on some tunneling under my, my other patio. Let's go look at that. So here we are, and there's this giant tree and it is growing under the patio. You can see it's got cracks all under here. And so we've dug a little trench. Oh, I got toys and things. And uh, trying to get those roots out. So I want a tool that I can use to tunnel underneath there and get the dirt out. And then I'm using a vacuum cleaner. Should be, yep, right there. Chop back with a dust collector on it. And the dust collector should let me get all the dirt out. I've tried it, it works pretty well. So I just need a mannequin. And the one we've got now is too big to swing around down there. So I'm gonna modify it. So the first thing is to get the handle shorter. So to do this, I think I want it to be about a span down. So right about there. So right underneath the head of the husky, I think, is where I'm going to cut it. So let's do that now. Go. Ah. So much more usable already. So now, in hack it stuff, but. Still too big, now it's way too wide. So I think I'm gonna make it about a span, which means trimming this back a bit. So all. It's over in the patio with the shop back. And it's in the patio because I was using it to cut the roots. Okay, reciprocating saw. Ah, there it is. How are we doing? Zero viewers, all right, good. Wouldn't wanna be disappointing anyone with my lack of planning. There's the power cord. It's probably sitting on the ground right next to the saw. Ah, oh dear. You might also notice that I'm wearing my headphones instead of normal protective earmuffs. And uh, it's because I don't know where the normal protective earmuffs are. They've gone away. I think the boys are playing with them. And Lost them somewhere. Yep, there it is. Power cord on the ground. In my efforts to avoid buying a real Matic, I figured, oh, I could just use a chisel. And so I bought a fairly large chisel. And it turns out that chisels don't work so great on Earth. Um, too dull, I guess? I don't know. But I tried to put on a handle, and this is what I came up with. So here's the chisel. And uh, yeah, just strapped it on with some monofilament. And it uh, doesn't work so great. Oh. This right here. Many things to plug in. Good. I really should be using a vice, but I don't have a vice. Maybe if you subscribe to my Patreon, I can afford one. Now that earmuffs don't cover my ears properly. So. We'll put some earplugs in instead. It's always nice to have protection for your ears and your eyes.
Making some progress. The cut's going through. Not there yet, but we'll get there eventually. Oh. Just took a tiny little chunk out of my finger. But it'll be fine. Let that dry. Still no viewers. All right. Good. Well, I don't have to pay attention to chat then. Oh, it's all the way through. Okay. Almost done. There. Okay. That is a much more usable Matic. Ah, there we go. That. Beautiful. Now I just have to sharpen up the edge here. It's pretty dull. So we'll clean that up, and uh, that is just wicked. Maybe we'll trim that a little bit down. Yeah. Oh, I want to do the handle too. Get this handle into a more hand shape. It's designed to slide your hand along to use it long like that. Uh, like this mat. It's designed to use like this one. So you grab it and then you have to slide your hand together and strike. But uh, since I'm going to be using one handed, I don't need to slide my hand along it all the time. So. We can uh, reshape the handle here to be a little more. One-handed friendly. This angle grinder is a 40 grit sending disc on it. Flat disc. Flat disc. And uh, it makes short work of wood. nicer. Much nicer. Grab it. It's nicely in the palm. Both ways. A little bit of the palm swell there. Yeah. Look nicely. So we now did this overhead power strip has been Fantastic. It's just wired into the. You can see it. Yeah, maybe you can see it there. It's wired into my garage door opener power. And uh, it works great. Got a fairly decent edge there, and a fairly decent edge there. I'm just going to cut anybody, but it should cut through dirt just fine. Let's go test it out. I'm going to try it in the dirt here. Yeah. 
a joy. That's it. Matic modified. <laughs>